don't know you know I'm a lady on the first day that I reggae dance hall and I bring to you and you and you what me say Jamaica from the outside and eh eh a Jamaica from the outside and I'm me proud to be a Jamaica but me say all of we barriers them are broke oh. All of we barriers, them are broke down. We are one united from the Japan. We put again a hit a spice up the phone. Hello family, welcome to another episode. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Today I'm in my backyard and I want to take you past my papaya tree. I want to take you to a special place. Now, earlier I was in my backyard, guys, and um, I was just cutting some sugar cane. Guys, I don't know anybody from Jamaica who don't like sugar cane. We grew up with it, so most of us have stories to tell about sugar cane, going to school and all of that. But you know something, I think I'm going to take you guys on a tour another day. One day I will take you on a tour in my backyard. But today I'm going to take you over to the star of the show. That is my gungo. So here we are guys, this is the gungo. They have been very fruitful. I really love gungo, I don't know about you guys, but most of us are used to having gungo at Christmas time especially you know and personally I prefer gungo to the red peas tell me in the comment section guys do you prefer gungo or the red peas um the truth is I haven't had much time to pick the gungo so there's a lot of dry one on them there's a lot of green ones but more are dry than I would care to but it doesn't matter. We prepare them anyway. It's just that the dry one takes a longer time to prepare. So here we are, guys. I'm going to be picking these gungo as much as I can today. Okay, family. So these are the dry gungo that I have picked and kept them separate. Not sure what I'm going to do with it. Now, if you have any suggestions, please tell me in the comment section. I prefer, much prefer the green ones. And let me show you how much of those green ones I got. These are the green ones, guys, that I got. And I think I'm going to use them for dinner today. So here we are, guys. I think I'm going to make some gunguan rice. So I have the gungo. I have some scallion, a little garlic thyme a green scotch bonnet some powdered seasoning all spice and uh, a pinch of salt of course i have a can of coconut milk i'm gonna do it the quick and easy way and i have my favorite rice jasmine rice guys let me show you how i'm going to prepare it I'm going to boil the gungu in plain water and add the garlic to it. We all know garlic is a tenderizer. I'm going to do that for about 10 minutes. add my seasoning the scallion the thyme the pimento or the allspice and of course the coconut milk
this point guys we just check in to make sure that the kungu is fairly soft and we're gonna check the taste we will adjust the taste if it is not to our liking guys here i'm going to just add about three cups of jasmine rice i'm going to wash it and add it to the peas and then i just give it a nice little stir lower the flame and let the rice cook my final step is to add a little tip of butter guys so there you have it guys i have checked my rice it is cooked the peas is cooked the taste is up guys tell me in the comment section what do you like to eat your kungu and rice with until next time guys